Connecticut joining states like New Jersey and Delaware in ending mask mandates in schools and other places, too. Joining us right now to talk more about it is Governor Ned Lamont of uh, Connecticut. And, Governor, thanks for being with us today. We have seen uh, just in the last week or so, I believe it's eight blue states that have said that they are going to be ending mask mandates now or very soon after. Um, and there's been a, a lot of discussion about this, just what prompted this at this point when, when the CDC is still saying that people should be wearing masks even if they're vaccinated. Hey, good morning, Becky. Yeah, we worked on this together as governors uh, throughout the region. Um, we thought this is a good time. We think it's a good time because our infection rates are back uh, low, hospitalizations are way down. And most importantly, People have the ability to keep themselves safe now. They have the ability to get boosted. They have the ability to wear the mask. We've got N95 masks to everybody. You're going back to school. We want you to get tested to prove that you're safe. I think we can do this safely. Is, is there frustration that the CDC didn't kind of move sooner to find an off-ramp or to describe when they thought things should be changing? I guess they have a nationwide mandate, so we decided to act on our own, act regionally. And by the same token, here in the state of Connecticut, I'm not saying no masks. I'm saying I'm going to leave it up to the city of New Haven. I'll leave it up to the town of Willimantic. I think they have the position to make the call now. What do you think will happen? I mean, just based on what you've seen so far, based on what you've heard, do you think this means that, that places of business, schools will pretty quickly drop those mask mandates as well? I had to guess, Becky, I think our um, major metropolitan areas will probably keep the mask on a little bit longer. They will perhaps hit harder, a little less likely to be vaccinated. I think our small towns will probably be quicker to say um, on February 28th, uh, we're ending the mask mandate in our towns. This decision that you all made, was it based on your expectations for where the virus is, where you expect it will be in the, in, in, in the coming weeks? Is there a level of transmission that would make you say, okay, the masks need to go back up? Well, first of all, you know, we had dropped by two thirds, three quarters over the previous uh, few weeks. We're not implementing this until February 28th. So that gives us another a couple of weeks or so to make sure these trends hold. Uh, there's no absolute me metric though, uh, Becky, because, you know, if it's Delta, you probably re really worry about um, an infection rate that's lower because it's so much more lethal. If it's Omicron, it was a bad case of the flu for anybody who was vaccinated. So we've got to be agile. 